Hey everybody, it is JPT! Here playing Anti-Squad. Now what is Anti-Squad? Well, it's an action-adventure strategy game with turn-based tactics. Right now it's $3.99 on Steam. Seems like a fun little game. I have not played this game before. I'm just saying, I've never played this game. It is early access, see? Bajow, early access. So, yeah, I think we'll just go ahead and click and see what happens. Yes, we want to get the tutorial in. This is a first impression kind of thing. I've never played this. All right, the tutorial modules will be accessible to you at any later point. We suggest that you start the game by playing through them. Oh yeah, let's do that. <laughs> let's get ourselves some rewards. All right. While Cactus was on leave, he decided to investigate the problem of a new synthetic drug being produced in his hometown in Mexico, or Mexico. Contacted a couple of friends from the, ooh, the DEA. Went undercover in the drug mafia's lair and disappeared without trace. No bueno. Teddy, radio check. <laughs> I love doing voices. Whatever possessed Cactus to come here alone? He's lucky he's still alive. First, adjust your devices. Let's test your camera. All right. Oh, hey now. Ah, I see. Now repeat. Move your camera onto the enemy. Uh, like that? You don't have to drag the map back to train the camera on your character again. Just click the character portrait on the left. Ah. This is the distance that you can move. Watch the red mark. This is the position from which you can successfully attack your opponent using at least one of your skills. Good to know. Now you're going to spend some of your action points. You can spend them on movement, special skills, and attacks. Music might be a little bit loud, by the way. I have no idea what he just said. <laughs> there we go. Your action points are limited. See, you've changed your position with very few action points left, but you still have enough to finish your enemy off. This is the maximum range of your weapon. Oh, okay, this yellow thing. Select an enemy. There are two ways to destroy him, by clicking on him repeatedly or clicking on the button on the right. Uh, select the enemy. Ah, I see. Yeah, kill him! <laughs> Ooh, click on him, search him. Yes, he's got coinage! And <laughs> leave some ketchup behind. There's nothing else you can do, so finish your turn. You click on this a big old buy. Oh yeah. Click a click. This is how the system shows the distance you can cover under the current conditions. I see. Let's move here. Click. Run, 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 run. Oh, that's cool. It tells you a little bit of the action as it's going uh going away. I'm trying to end the turn. Have a look around and move toward the gate. I'm trying. There we go. Tap the button to open the gate. Ah, I see. So it's really m kind of mouse based. Now go outside. Go, 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 go. <laughs> awesome. Row, row. Gotta end my turn. Got a posse up here. Note the gray circles. They indicate the enemy's range of vision. Oh, I see. Select them and double click their portrait on the right. Oh, that's cool. You have to do it real fast. He's an assaulter. This is important. Note the enemy stats shown on the right. The enemy could be quick or slow, dangerous at close range or at distance. Dangerous at medium range. I see. You can, oh, you can't scroll. What about this guy? Oh, they want me to head back. Okay. What else? It is a tutorial. Move to the selected location. No problem. Click, click, click. Select this cell. Okay. 
By scouting the area, you can determine which of your opponents is the most deadly. For example, this symbol indicates that should you move to the target location, the enemy will be within your firing range. I see. A similar red symbol indicates that the enemy will be able to counterattack because they have enough AP. Now finish your turn. <laughs> finish your turn, soldier. Uh-oh. And here's the symbol for a counterattack. Oops, forgot to activate something. This is your armor. Every shield fully absorbs all damage from a single hit before it's destroyed. You can also find this information on the ground and near the character portraits. Oh, jeez. Oh, he counterattacked. He dead. You dead man. And we're gonna move here. Okay. It puts me down to zero pointage. Uh-oh. Big ol' shotgun. What happens now? The fist icon shows the range of close combat. Oh, that's cool. So we can get up in his face and punch him. But, and then click on him. With the knife. What? Oh, <laughs> to the gut. <laughs> Sweet. Now what? Oh gosh! <laughs> this is a good dude, right? Ah, sweet. Glad to see you guys. What took you so long? They've been really putting on the heat on me. Ooh. <laughs> oh, he, he, yeah. He did pass out. Cactus is seriously injured. So click on him. And do the sippy edge. I don't want to do mouth to mouth, do I? Take a deep breath and do something. Uh, so now I can do it. There we go. Good. No mouth to mouth. I'm okay with that. <laughs> Luckily, I took that first aid kit off the jailers. I read that as sailors at first. You can switch back and forth. Fills up 50 HP. Very nice. We've got company. Get out now. <laughs> kind of runs weird. Achievement unlocked, newbie. Very cool. Victory! Cactus disappeared. No difficulty bonus. Womp womp. Did get that though. Go, 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 go. Okay, so here we go. Shooting range is yellow. Close combat is the yellow. Moving distance is the gray. And point of attack is the red dots. Ah, from this position, the character can launch at least one attack. Gray circles indicate points of which a character can reach during the current turn. Some characters can use their close range attacks from these points and. Again, the yellow dots indicated the range of a barrel. Very nice. Look, these are team contracts. Meanwhile, two more team members, Sunny and Rose, undertook a rescue mission to free Cactus from the Mafia. You must successfully withdraw from the drug cartel territory. Okay. Each one of these includes a few missions. You can see the mission list on the left. All right. So that's the one we did. We can always repeat it. <laughs> and this is the next one. Alright, well let's do it. We can do it, right? Wait, what's this? Let's just try this one out and see what happens. Meanwhile, two more team members, Sunny and Rose, undertook part of a rescue mission to free Cactus. She must accomplish this part to successfully withdraw the whole team from the drug cartel territory. Ooh, nice. Rose, our task is to ensure a clean getaway from the whole team, and we must both survive. I like the variety of characters so far. I love the music. The music is great. Let's look around. Ruh -ruh. So many twins. While there are two armed enemies present, we will not be able to deal with the entire group at once. Oh, okay. Rose throws an X... Wait, what did that say? 
armor destroying acid. Whoa, man. I need to get in close for it to work, though. I can't throw the armor destroying acid more than two squares away from me. Well, that's not good. And throw it right into the center of the group. Only then you'll be able to. Fa oh, okay. Well, that makes sense, I guess. So. You need to monitor the amount of action points has left. Okay. So that'll require 48. Hmm. Move closer, select the cell, and throw the acid. Well, this is where they want me to move. Oh, and I have enough. Okay, cool. And I want to throw it there. Ah, uh, I see. Very nice. Sunny covers the area with this. I, the, that, that's too fast. I'm sorry. That needs to be up faster. Now it's my turn. I need to move to the next cell and use my bullet storm ability. I have no idea what this is, by the way. If you highlight a cell in the center of an enemy group, the fire will go through the area and it can take out all the enemies at once. Well, that's cool. So we're going to move here. Oh, 50 is how many you'll have left. I thought it was how many you're going to use. So then we click here. And then click on this. Whoa! Crazy! That's it. Death in one simple move. Wow. That seems super powerful. Oh, here comes some more guys. Wow. She is surrounded. Oh. Uh. Complete tutorial. Okay. <laughs> that was a very short one. Let's do one more, then maybe I'll call it quits. Okay, so the location of El Rombo's drug labs is unknown. According to intelligence, someone named Dealer has been has the information that you need. He is the intermediary between cartels and was recruited a couple years ago. Um, I'm trying to read the rest of it. Uh, oh, okay. Because clicking on the arrows would makes sense, but you click on this. He's a solitary man, lives in the desert. His motives aren't clear enough, but there's no choice. Let's do this. Ooh, I get to choose my players. Um... I liked... Or just click the icon. Um, I don't know if I liked her a whole lot. I didn't even get to see this guy. Let's do these two guys. Oh, do we hire one of these people? Oh, okay. Uh, oh, she's super expensive. We only have a thousand. So we go back. Um, use this guy. I guess that was really confusing as to what I'm doing here. Oh, uh, normal. <laughs> it's just like, I thought that was a loading screen. Look at this dump. This is the crummiest place in the world. I'd rather watch paint dry than in be here. I hope you don't mind my asking, but how does one keep track of all the nasty business conducted by the local crime boss? He's a local. They don't get paid to think. All they care about is girls, sleep, and food. Okay, is everyone gonna talk? Yeah, they caught me off guard when I was covering for the DEA boys. They sniffed him out and bit him like a pretzel. Relax, man. You've got screwed up. Your D boy's really messed up. I know, that's not how it read. But we'll sort it out. Can I click anywhere to get this to go on? Okay, yeah, you can. You don't have to click on the arrow. I want to go through then and get inside. Oh my gosh. Proceed to the mark point. Ooh, this is going to take a minute. This is going to take a hot minute. Let's do this. And you can zoom out by using your mouse scroll. Let's uh, let's work smarter, not harder. I think we're gonna go this way. Let's go that way. It's gonna leave us with zero. And in the turn, right? Yeah. 
It double checks on the end turn thing, which I kind of like. First, I was kind of annoyed by it, but I don't mind it so much. And I'm probably going to die. <laughs> don't mind me. I'm just going this way because I think I'm smart. Um, yeah, let's move here. Can I shoot anybody from here? No. What about from here? No. Um, yeah. Let's move there. And in the turn. Where are these guys going? I love, 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 love turn-based games. Oh, gosh. See this enemy with an exclamation mark over his head? It's an indicator warning that you are... That he's alert and angry. How? He doesn't even know who I am. He's much more alert. Alright, cool. Whatever. Let's zoom down. Alright, so we can get down pretty good. Can you move? Let's check what the... Um... Indication... Okay, so it's not really giving me any kind of control commands, at least none that I can see. Wow, I have music on too, and it seems really loud to me, but maybe that's just me. Oh, useful info, maybe? Um, no, I don't know what all this stuff is. Eh, whatever. Let's stop messing with this stuff. Let's just play. Let's get to play. So I can... Attack this guy with... Oh, yeah. First blood. John Rambo, first blood. Can I get this guy? No, but I could stab him if I got close enough. Um, let's go here. Now can I shoot him? Yes. Oh. Can you move the camera? That's all I want to do. Whoa, <laughs> I just moved my entire window. Sorry about that. No good. Let's move here. Let's just let's just go full balls. And in the turn. Now it's the enemy's turn. These guys are weird. <laughs> Not so smart, are you? Ooh. Walked around the corner. Go here. I'll shoot him. The enemy can see me. Okay. Can I shoot this guy? Oh yeah. I'm in trouble. But I can shoot this guy. Oh gosh. He's gonna be a tough one. In the turn. So you get the gist of the game, right? Ooh, look through my armor. And he killed me. <laughs> Loss of innocence. Battle casualties. So yeah, I mean, it's, it seems like a pretty fun game. I mean, I got defeated and I still like it, you know? But it seems like a, it seems like a pretty fun game that I could get behind. So you may or may not see more of these videos. I may just play a little bit more of this and see if I really like it. Uh, but yeah, let me know what you guys think of this game. Do you guys want to see more of Anti-Squad? If that's the case, then, well, let me know. If not, let me know either way. Leave those likes, leave those comments. And by all means, leave those subscriptions. We'll see what happens. These challenges are for you, fighter, but completing them in the course of your mission, you can earn coins. Total progress for the challenges, okay? When you reach these points, you will be rewarded, but don't have to accept every challenge. Coins are rewarded for reaching at this point. Oh, so I got one. Battle casualties. Cool. So yeah, again, that's Anti-Squad. I'm JPT. Go play your games. And I'll be seeing you.